Welcome to this reporting tutorial. This shows tabulated features, point details and feature profile. Okay, so I'm going to select the appropriate report types. I'm going to choose feature profile as well. Now we need to choose which feature to report. So we're going to click on add feature. We're going to use our reference circle, which I've measured with quite a number of points. So if you right click on it, you can see you've taken 39 points and you can see some form error. So at the moment, the plus or minus five micron bands are showing. I can change those to whatever I like. If I let the top one and the bottom will also change. So I can change the bottom one independently. I can adjust the zoom to suit my report. So I'm going to run these reports. Okay, the first one's tabulated features. So we've got a list of features as we measured them. So feature one was a plane, we've got a direction vector, number of points, and a geometric value. And this just continues. So you also have circles, lines. So the information is not really a dimensional one, purely the information about the feature. This is point unit details. So this lists every feature which is regarded as a point. So in this case, all the circles have a center, so they're regarded as points. But we'll also include point intersections or points measured. So we list a position and an error, but it's not a true position report. And finally, we have our feature profile. So graphically shows the error of the feature. So we have the form error, plus or minus tolerance, and a nice graphic showing what the problems are. 